If you have sheep and goats, you need to learn to trim their hooves. The side walls of the hoof grow faster than they wear down, and so they need to be trimmed. The whole point of trimming the hoof is to keep it rot free as well as comfortable to walk on. You will need clean, sharp hoof trimmers. These can be purchased at your local feed or tax store and from many online retailers. Have the animal restrained or someone else holding the animal. Here, Linda is demonstrating how to lift the front and back legs for trimming. Here you can see where the side wall of the hoof has grown long and curved over the sole of the foot. This creates a place where dirt collects and infections can start. Clean out any dirt with a hoof pick or the tips of your trimmers. Trim the side walls of the hoof and the heel down so that they are even and flat with the sole of the foot. Trim any other loose pieces of the hoof. You may trim the sole if necessary. Trim the toes and any excess between the two heel areas. Trim slowly and carefully until you start to see pink. Once you see pink, stop or you will cause the goat to bleed. <laughs> On really bad feet, it is often better to trim as best as you can and come back and do a little more a few weeks later. It may take a few trimmings before the feet start to look normal. If you encounter a dirty pocket or the wall of the hoof separating from the hoof, you need to totally trim this out until it is open and clean. Leave no dirt or you risk hoof rot. If your animal is limping and has a pocket like this, you can suspect foot rot. If there is a foul odor, it may be foot scald. This is actually a healthy hoof. She may have just stepped on something and broke part of her hoof. You're shooting for a nice, relatively flat sole with no dirty pockets. Remember to trim slowly and carefully until you see pink. Here you can see where we have reached pink, and so we need to stop trimming or it will cause the goat to bleed. You can set sheep on their rear ends to trim their hooves. Turn the animal's head back onto her body, which makes her sit down. Then lift her up in a sitting position. Sheep can be handled this way and generally will sit still so you can trim hooves. Some animals will require more hoof trimming than others. If animals have access to rocks and rough surfaces, you might not have to trim hooves as often because they stay naturally trimmed. For sheep and goats to stay productive, they must have hooves in good condition.